So I'm just going to make a channel and we're gonna buy the BMW M4 and this is my first review video in the crew motor fit. Let's stroll in the intro. It cost 380 grand. Okay. Then I painted the green is for M3. M4. Ooh, this looks nice. This blue is gonna be good. Let's go for it. This blue. Where it was. Dooja. I know what I'm going for. You might be like, that's so ugly, but that is special. Which you think? It is a front F4D transmission. F4D transmission. What? It has 510 bhp, 1800 kilograms is the weight. Drive it, obviously. Speed, 290 top speed. Acceleration, 398. I wish they had an HQ or something, like where I could review the forest the way I did in Crew 2. Like, use my camera, open the doors, focus on specific things. We don't have that anymore, so I really miss that. This is the interior review. I actually absolutely love this interior just because of the fact it's the newer one. Because we don't have any new uh, BMWs except the M8 and the C4 in, in the crew tool. And yeah, um, uh, we got really good looking screen. The speedometers are nice. If you know, all main forward there, carbon steering looks really good. Uh, the buttons, the doors look amazing. The seats look really sporty. Um, down there, we also have the gear shifter and other things. Oh, uh, the rear seats they also look pretty good. Let's do the sound test. I think it actually sounds really nice. It's not super loud, but it's really good. The game is not letting me open the camera mode. Look at this. 10 minutes later. This is the exterior view and I'm gonna do it in the main game camera because it's not letting me open the photo mode and I tried a lot. So from the side the car looks amazing, the ribs look amazing, the side light, the vent looks really good, and the pole profile, the coupe style, is amazing. From the back you can't really go wrong with that F4, look at the lights, the lava lights at all. This looks so freaking good. So, a lot of people hate the front, but I think it looks so good. It's like growing up on a lot of people as well. It, I just, I just think it looks amazing. Let's be able to use it. It's gonna be fun. Do you need recommendations, driver? Do not forget, this is stock. I haven't even upgraded this car yet. Let's do a 0 to 200 test. 3, 2, 1, go. So the 0 to 100 was done in 3.4 seconds, I think. And the 0 to 200 was done in 8 seconds. This is a voice recording later and then I turn it into the AI. 
uh, to enhance the voice and remove background noise. So that's why I sometimes forget the numbers. I'm gonna do it again because it was downhill, so that's not really fair. Let's do it over here. It might be able to do it. Wait, let's go to the highway. Three, two, one. It took 3.22 seconds, now it got 0.2 seconds faster than the previous run and it got slower for 0 to 100. It took 10.2 seconds now, instead of 8. This is the brake test. Two hundred to zero in three point fourteen seconds. Now I will be doing the event with this car, LBWK. A playlist is available, driver. The next playlist in our catalog tackles another key aspect of worldwide car culture: car customization. To show you the right way to rethink an existing car design, Motorfest went the extra mile and got in touch with a real master craftsman. That's right, this playlist is 100% inspired by the work of an unrivaled auto-tuning pioneer, Mr. Watarukato himself and his signature brand, Liberty Walk. We're here. Here comes Liberty Walk, introduced by Mr. Kato himself. リバティオークプレイリストへようこそ加藤渡です。このニオンからこのゲームでしか楽しめない素晴らしい体験をお送りします。30年以上も世界中の車をリバティオークスタイルでカスタムしてきました。みんなが驚き喜ぶ。テレビカスタムカーで日本の伝統を大切にしながら作っています。その作品をこのモーターフェスト7ではの体験を通じてチェックしてみてください。リバティオークの世界を旅して。I'm gonna get to keep Liberty Walk M4. Why did I buy the normal edition? I'm so stupid. This is Liberty Walk, a step beyond the boundaries of customization. You know what I should do every car that I bought in Crudo, I should retest them in this game on that track. Hey, it's Toji. Remember me? Made in Japan, the pack, the guy with the Evo X. Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't. You shouldn't be surprised. It's a Liberty Walk playlist. I'm a customizer. That's all I needed to know. is the mecca of tuning. There's lots of things to say. But let's start with this. In Japan, every Kusto lover knows the name Wataru Kato. Bringing his own style to bear on supercars. That's his thing. Mm. 
Man, okay, th that should have been an easy turn. BMW, you let me down over there. Okay, the controls are not perfect just because of the fact that I haven't modified them or I mean like set them according to my likings like I did in the crew too. So that's why this is probably not perfect. Whoa, that's nice. Let's go.
now that I've maxed the car performance, it has 831 bhp and the weight is still 1800 kg, 361 top speed, 3.2 acceleration and 19.6 meter is braking. So we're gonna test that out, the braking and acceleration. Back to where we left off. So here is the speed test with max performance and also I won't be doing a track test today because of the fact that I don't know the track right now. I haven't figured it out. I need to practice uh, practice on it and then I can do track tests for all the cars. And my goal is to test every single car that I did in Crew 2 in this game as well. Zero to hundred was done in two point two three seconds, and zero to two hundred was done in six point two one seconds, which is insanely quick. The zero to one hundred is crazy for a car like this. That's like Bugatti numbers. Here's the brake test with mass performance. And during this workshop, you'll be driving the oh so lovely Nissan three seventy six. So this video took me so long to make, just because of the fact I was really really sick and i had to get operated operated for appendix and that's why i was in hospital and it took me so long to edit this video but i'm finally done with it and i'm impressed with it i'm i think it's really good so hopefully you guys also enjoy it and yeah there's also going to be a vlog uh soon and there's a lot of videos that i plan hopefully this video does good because i've put so much work into it i just got like home three days ago Today, today is the third day and I just started working on this video. Hopefully you guys love it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.